So uh, obviously maneuver when you're talking about dynamic space, space operations and all of the, the work that has been done over the past three years to, to get that maneuver without regret as a term uh, of art, uh, that was, was an obvious choice. But when I looked at the, the adaptability that, that we could change the way we operate our systems and make them more flexible, it, it, I realized that we could create challenges and dilemmas for our adversaries yeah, right now we're focused a lot on avoiding operational surprise, but what we can do with our adaptability and flexibility is induce operational surprise in the minds of our adversaries. And I think that's a key element. And, and of course, it's a, a time proven technique uh, that goes back to you know, the earliest days of, of warfare. And so I was very uh, interested in how those two aspects can work together uh, to create uh, surprise and potentially keep the adversary off balance so that we have seized the initiative and maintain it.